Here I have a just algebra question for you guys. We are given that x is equal to square root of 2000 and y is equal to square root of 2001. And we are going to compute this expression. And I will tell you guys that this is actually from the math league contest. In the year of, take a guess, is it 2000 or 2001? 2001. Okay, so it's this question right here. All right. So pretty good question for just algebra. Anyway, pause the video and try this first. Done? Good. All right, so of course, put this here, put this here, and then, no, no. Here's the deal. If we are given an algebraic expression, it might be a better idea just to work it out algebraically. So in fact, you can have square root of any other numbers. Just do the expression like this first and then plug in a number at the end. It might be easier that way. So let's go ahead and try this out. So here, when we have x plus y squared, this is just x squared plus 2xy plus y squared. Right? Remember, we have to expand the binomial, and we have the middle part right here. All right? And then when we have the minus version, it's just a minus 2xy in the middle. But that's the plus in the middle. Work that out. We get x squared minus 2xy plus y squared. Aha! So, you see that this is equal to that, and the good thing is, what do we see? The 2xy, 2xy actually cancel because this here is a positive 2xy, and this right here is a minus 2xy, perfect. And then we have x squared plus x squared, which is just 2x squared. So let me put it down like so. And then we add, this right here is y squared plus another y squared, so that's 2y square. Now, plug in the square root numbers. We have 2 times the square root of 2000, and then square. Then we add 2 times y, which is the square root of 2001, and then square. The beauty of this is that square root square cancel nicely, this and that cancel nicely, we just get the inside back. And then right here, just go ahead and multiply 2 times 2,000, so we have 4,000. And then we add 2 times 2,001, and that's 4,002. Finally, combine them, we get 7,000, no, yeah, you know it, 8,002, done. All right, so that's it. Um, again, the idea is that work out the algebra first before you plug in any numbers. That's why we like to simplify the algebra expressions. Yeah. So for more videos like this, check out the playlist right here. I'll see you guys in there.